Okay, y'all, we're... to watch the cars have no idea what we're looking at <laughs> he backing up I guess he want to be a part of the lineup I don't know what's so spectacular about his vehicle but it's an Escalade is that what an Escalade is look like he could have washed it so look at this this is a Porsche like the color he could have cleaned his windshield a little better like the color that's a pretty color y'all and look at this old i guess everybody gets a spot <laughs> look at this old ford y'all so i don't know if there is a Judgment, look at this. I love that green. That is pretty. Look at that engine. Look how clean the engine is, y'all. How could an engine be so clean? Look at this. It's a 1970 Chevy Impala. It's clean, y'all. That car too clean. That's nice. <laughs> and look at this one. This is nice. I don't know if it has a drop top. I don't know if they have a drop top. So they're entering a contest. Is it a contest? Um, I think it's a car show. Okay. But yeah, I think she's the one you There's a people's choice award, so a dollar a ticket, or, you know, there's less than you buy more. The girl with the pink box, so at the registration, just look at the number in the windows. This is nice. Oh, this is nice. I might do that. People's choice, you vote. Please don't touch. Oh, this is nice. I like this. Let me see what they say. Gray paint in. Yes, it's ugly, but it's original. And they have motorcycles. They have motorcycles. He got rocks. I thought that was Chucky on that bike. I was like, I'm not voting for him. <laughs> I thought that was Chucky. I thought that was Chucky, y'all. Yeah. Just look at this one, y'all. This is just an old beat up. A old beat up truck. Don't even have the side mirrors on it. I don't know if they did this paint job they sell. That's a nice truck. Hi. And what is this? Look, he got a nice presentation. Quicksilver driving. That's nice. He got his own little mat down here. He fixing it up. Look at that. That's nice. He's paying attention to detail. Ford Mustang. Oh, 
please look at Meyer and enjoy this Ford Mustang. But don't touch. Don't touch. Look, he got his own little stand. I'm telling you, he went all out. Best display. Yes, he does have the best display, you guys. I must admit. First place custom. So he must have won a couple of awards. Buffo. He letting you know that he is the one to beat. Oh, look at this, y'all. Now this, I like this right here. Now that is beautiful. That is beautiful. Now that's a classic. That is a classic. That is nice. Y'all, I love antique vehicles. That's another love of mine. I love to do van life in an antique vehicle. One day, y'all, if we get rich and famous, we could do whatever we want to do. Now, this is a Mercedes. This is a Mercedes. So, y'all, let me know in the comments bar below which one would you vote for. People's Choice. Let me know which one would you vote for. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. A nineteen sixty seven Dodge, a hundred percent garage built. Engine is clean, y'all. How do they keep their engines so clean? They must don't dry these things. How does the engine stay so clean? I kind of, I don't know which one is going to be my favorite. You guys, this is nice. But y'all let me know. I like to see one of these on the road. It's, it's for sale too. Y'all let me know which one would you vote for. This is probably one of the first vehicles Ford made. Look at this, y'all. Wow. Wow. What the heck is going on? Wow. Look at that. Everything pops up. Woo, look at the suspension. Look at the engine. Do they drive these things? That's all I wanna know. Do y'all drive them? Look at this one. A monster. Now that is a monster truck for sure. Look at that. Look at the monster truck. Look at them tires. Girl, how much one of these tires cost? That's all I want to know. Look at them tires, y'all. Wow.
This is where they spend their money at. This is where they spend their money at. Look at the inside. How do they keep their engine so clean, y'all? I need, I need to raise my engine up. I need to raise my engine up. So this one is for sale. This one is for sale. The old little buggy that they used to go make grocery deliveries on. This is cute. It's cute. This is cute. Okay, I have no idea which one I'm gonna vote for. <laughs> That's cute though. Look at that, y'all. That is classic. Okay, we're at the beginning of the line over here, so. Clean engine. That's when engines were a piece of art. Nah, they just throw that stuff together. Look at the dog in there. Now they just throw it together. And that's it. Okay, we're at the beginning of the list. So I'm gonna start at the beginning of the list and do a post for Instagram to see which one I'm gonna vote okay, for. Okay, y'all, I just got through voting for a couple of cars at the car show. I voted for number 13, I think, and number 10. I kind of want to vote for two more. I would like to vote for one. They should have a category for best presentation, but they didn't. So, uh, and I'm now I'm walking around and looking at the boots. Looks like this is like a booth with used items. So let me just have a look see y'all. Let's just have a look see. Whew, this knot in the back of this thing is hurting. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. 
just passing by this vendor. They asked me did I want to try some samples. So I'm going to try some samples for you guys and let y'all know how they are. This is the real food What? Tayo food. It means us. In Filipino, it means us. Tayo food Tayo. company. So I'm going to try some spicy gumbo. Yeah. And you can try this chicken in a little bit. Spicy gumbo, y'all. Mm. <laughs> it's hot on a warm day, on a cold day. It'll warm you up. It got sausage, some okra. I love okra. Mm. It's seasoned good. Supposed to be spicy, but y'all know I don't really like spicy food, so it's not too spicy. That was good. This is the chicken. The chicken looked like it had more okra in it. I like okra. There's a website which is tayofoods.com. Videos, recipes. Tayofoods.com, you guys. Good, y'all. This is my first meal of the day. Ah, yes, sir. How much is this? Is the product that you're eating? Uh huh. Motivation behind this is all organic. myself a little allowance to taste stuff but I've so been doing the carnivore diet for about six months. Yeah, what do they call that though? The, uh, the all meat diet? There's a name for that. What's, what's it's, that? It's called the carnivore diet. What's the all meat diet? Uh, the lion's diet. The lion's oh. diet. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what I do. Yeah, I, I don't eat meat. You won't get any argument from me. I wish I had barbecue for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but every now and then I give myself a little grace. Yeah, well, I appreciate and, it. I mean, y'all give me what you think of the flavor. Yeah, it tastes good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was, it was pretty good. Seasoned real good. The seasonings to me are very important. The onion and the bell pepper and all that stuff. Because I still cook with that on the carnivore diet. And that makes a break from the way that I cook. That yeah. makes a break everything. The onion, the bell pepper, the garlic. Little mushroom. Yeah. yeah. Mushroom. I love mushroom. Yeah. So. I, I just had a whole skillet of mushrooms and onions and the bell peppers last week. We mixed it in with a few different dishes. So I'll feature y'all on my YouTube channel, Vanessa's Van Life Journey. Let's say it again. Vanessa's Van Life Journey. Yeah, so very much you're going to be on there. <laughs> so y'all, if y'all want to check out some gumbo uh, seasonings, this is an all natural gumbo seasoning mix. Uh, a lot of my subscribers don't eat like me. <laughs> they eat everything. She ate one. So uh, if y'all want to check them out, what's the website again? Tayofoods.com. T-A-Y-O. Uh, oh, it's right here, y'all. Tilefoods.com. Check them out. And I really like this. What was this called? Beignet. Beignet. It was really good, you guys. So, y'all have a blessed day. And you guys, over here, they have funnel cakes. And it's $10 for the funnel cakes, y'all. I can't afford one. I'd have to split one with somebody. <laughs> 
You want to split a funnel cake? <laughs> Look, you guys, ten dollars for a funnel cake, and they have popcorn. walk around I don't know if they're still doing the hot air balloon I think they might have put it up already are they still doing the hot air balloons okay okay they do them again in, in the evening So what time they do that? Uh, sundown. Okay. Just after it gets dark. Yeah, I definitely want to see that. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. So beautiful. Let's see what tricks they have up their sleeves. here all day you guys beautiful you doing Vanessa? 